Welcome back everybody. Um, so recently I did a little bit of a trip over to the, uh, the US and I flew into uh, Dallas, Fort Worth, Texas and a little bit of a visit into Amarillo, Texas and then took a long, 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 long journey with uh, Carl and Robin Jacobson all the way over to Oregon and flew out from um, Seattle, Washington. Um, and this is uh, this is our travel vlog. So uh, it's a little bit um, it's a little bit lengthy, um, but yeah, it's it's going to show you uh, all our little antics, where we went, what we did, and what we saw. So uh, yeah, enjoy. Okay, everybody. So I'm going to be trying this uh, this voiceover thing, and this is our uh, our trip to America, so you can see us. Uh, See a few pictures here. So this is obviously Vicky and I in the uh, in the waiting area, ready to go. And it's obviously me looking uh, very waiting, very patiently to uh, board our plane, which you can see just right about there. Going by American Airlines. We're finally got on board the uh, on board the plane, and Vicky's first time flying. And there uh, is a bit of footage of that. Just leaving, uh, just leaving London Heathrow. Uh, a couple of pictures just coming out the window. There's uh, Texas from the uh, out the window, and there's Dallas. There you go, and there's uh, a video now coming up of us uh, coming into land. So obviously, you've seen Vicky's first takeoff. Now this is Vicky's first that ever landed. Are you ready for it? Getting really close to now. You ready? Ready to push that really tall, mate. Ready? And. Touchdown in America. There you go. And we've landed. And one of our first things we see is a uh, police car. We thought it was a thing to come, but luckily it wasn't. And we finally meet up with Carl and Robin, and the road trip begins. And uh, finally sat down at the table, we'll see the famous Paul Jackman uh, pallet table. And one of the uh, many selfies um, happened to go in, and obviously a selfie with me with the trailer. Had to be done. And uh, obviously we had to sign the trailer, just like many of other famous and uh, good folk that have done that beforehand. And uh, Carl and I went for a quick walk. Just before we met up with uh, Bobby and Nicole Duke. There we go, we went out for dinner. We all had burgers. So, yeah, we all did that. There's, uh, there's Mr. Duke. And also, they signed, uh, they signed the trailer as well. There you go, there's Nicole. And we'll see the, uh, the group photo. Shortly before the uh, the flooding incident, then off to Amarillo to go and uh, see Jake. And uh, yeah, on the way we uh, we happened to see a few things I've never seen before, like tumbleweed, for example, and uh, then a massive dust cloud or dust storm, whatever you want to say. And then we arrived at Jake's. Thanks to Jake for the CCTV footage. And obviously that's uh, one of my favourite projects of Jake's that we've done. And then obviously we, uh, I had to catch up with family uh, 
Harry was up and back home, and then we went for dinner at the famous Texas Steak Ranch Steakhouse. That's where they did the, the famous 72 ounce steak, which I didn't take on, I actually only had a quarter of that, but apparently it's a rule that you've got to have a steak in Texas, so that's what I did. Then it was a uh, then it was off to bed. It was, uh, we were up early in the morning to go to Cadillac Ranch. Yeah, it's quite a uh, quite an amazing place. That place, how thick the paint actually is. Thanks, Jake. Obviously I couldn't go there without spraying a few things on there myself. Had to be done. There you go, team scroll saw. So Carl had this blank um, plan to turn for when we got there, so Jake had to go over a few safety rules first. Uh, before you get started, you need any advice or anything? Uh, yeah, so, so now this machine is called a lathe, right? I think so. Okay, oh, well. all, right. all right, let's do it. And he gets to turning. Now we're just going over the rules of the old Texas turn off before we get started and here we go. Notice the, uh, the little bit of a jump that Carl took to get onto his uh, pedestal like he needs it, like he's not tall enough already. Here we go. One of the 
coolest parts of this trip, I think. Jake, Carl and myself all turning at exactly the same time. Can't beat it. I still feel I won, but the other two might debate it. And in the evening, the awesome David Birch came over to say hi and have something to eat with us. So it was uh, great to meet you there, David. Hope to see you again soon, sir. And after that, we, uh, Jake and I set about making a blank, which uh, Carl and I will be turning once we return to Oregon, and uh, we'll be doing a collaboration. And uh, as soon as it's done, there will be a link in the description, and I'm sure I'll put one up in the cards as well. about to come out of the pressure pot. Time for Thanksgiving and a little pumpkin pie. God damn! There we go. Huge thanks to Jake's family for hosting us for that. Then it was back to Jake's shop for a few last minute photos. And then uh, it was uh, Bye Bye Texas. And then it was uh, on the road to Roswell, New Mexico. You already start seeing. Um, Aliens and things like that as we approach the uh, the Roswell Museum. And when we get a get a a little bit of a show. Oh, we obviously taken back by it a little bit. Me, I loved it.
Roswell Museum, we were back on the road. Actually, just about here, Carl really came out of his shell. We're off to Never Never Land! Parked up, paid homage to our uh, good friend DJ, and then up early again for the next stretch of road. And now we're going towards Arizona. While we were there, we came across Eloy, so I messaged him to see if it was okay if we had a bit of a visit. He said yes, so I thought it would be alright to take a few more pictures. Yeah, so after that, we, uh, we, uh, we visited Eloy, and we're back driving towards Courtside, Arizona where we stopped for a spot of lunch and uh, took, a lot of, uh, took a look at a lot of rocks and petrified wood and glass and sculptures and uh, all sorts of stuff. A real good place that was. And I took a few pictures of a trailer, a cactus, a palm tree, and we're back on the road again, heading for Pyramid Lake, California.
and after that visit we stepped off at Bakersfield, California. Not without any problems though, hashtag not my fault. Then obviously in the morning we headed north. This is where Kyle and I just baited on starting a yoga channel and Vicky and I struggled to make s'mores. But in the morning we got back on the road and headed towards uh, Klamath, California to the Trees of Mystery to see Paul Jackman's twin. After that visit we were back on the road once again to the Oregon coast in Bandon. back to the RV park and we spent two nights there and in the morning we headed to the Evergreen Aviation and Space Museum where the Spruce Goose is kept Of course they had to point out the scroll store. And then we ended up going to um, see a few waterfalls and this is actually one of the first times I've ever seen a waterfall that's not been powered by a pump. I actually bought a size of a uh, bag of cookies the size of my head and I actually didn't get any of them but it was worth it just for the looks I got. So this is uh, Bonville Dam. Um, we went there to see the fish but uh, to be honest we had more fun feeding the duck.
and of course only I could find a giant acorn in the gift shop. We finally got to Carl Robin's house and whilst Jack was busy greeting Vicky, Carl and I got to work on our collab piece we made in Texas. Finally, one last picture. There we go, before heading back to Seattle for our flight home. The airplane and about to take off. Here we go. From the stop. Hey again everybody, as you can see I'm back home and in my workshop so if you made it this far I applaud you, it was quite a lengthy video. Um, now in the vid end of the video I'll just, uh, I only uh, thanked um, Carl and Robin. Now I do want to thank Carl and Robin again, it, uh, it couldn't have been easy um, putting up with me and Vicky for the, the, the few weeks that we were together. I mean, um, floods, broken wheels. Um, yeah. Um, anyway, uh, I just want to thank uh, Carl and Robin again. Anyway, um, for the for the two weeks, it was it was great spending time with you. Uh, but I also want to thank Jake for the uh, for hosting us for a few days, uh, allowing us to go into his workshop. I can't say that we got in the way. Um, I mean, we was able to park the trailer into his workshop, put three laves out at the same time, do some turning and still have time to walk around. Yeah. Um, but thanks anyway. Uh, I want to thank Jake's family for hosting us for Thanksgiving. Um, that was an excellent time. Um, I've never experienced a Thanksgiving before so that was the first, hopefully not the last. Um, I want to thank Cole's family it was a pleasure to uh, meet you all. Um, can't wait to see you again. Uh, I want to thank uh, Donna for hosting Vicky and I for dinner. Um, always a pleasure to see you. And don't forget, if you ever want any stuff from England, I'm only a message away. Um, and I can't forget Dale from Maple Tree Studios and Richard from the Beard Time 16. If it weren't for you two, I wouldn't have been able to get to the airport. So, yeah, thanks very much, guys. And uh, until the next video, I'll see you soon.